you're watching News 8 Now, I'm Erin O'Valley. In Londonderry, New Hampshire this morning, the SWAT team has surrounded the home of a woman who was shot early yesterday morning in Saco during a violent home invasion. We know that so far, nobody has been arrested. The shooting happened on Hillview Avenue at the home of 55-year-old Stephen and Carol Shabbat. The Londonderry woman, Rachel Owens, both suffered multiple gunshot wounds and were taken to Maine Med for surgery. Shabbat's wife was not injured. Investigators say the shooting does not appear to be random. Well, for the second time this week, a threat is keeping students home, this time in Saco. Police are continuing to investigate a phone call to Thornton Academy. News 8's Morgan Sturdivant is in Saco with more on the school's late night decision to stay closed until next year. Investigators are working aggressively to find out who made a threatening phone call that sent students home from school yesterday at Thornton Academy. Officials aren't saying anything specific about the nature of the threat while they continue to investigate. While officials say the students were never at any risk, their safety is the top priority. Officials say it's still too early into the investigation to tell the threat is connected at all with the Wyndham incident earlier this week, but we've been told that it was directed only toward Thornton Academy. SACO POLICE SAY THAT MOVING FORWARD, THERE WILL BE A BIT MORE OF A POLICE PRESENCE HERE AT THE SCHOOL TO ENSURE THE STUDENT SAFETY. AND AGAIN, CLASSES WILL RESUME HERE AFTER THE NEW YEAR ON JANUARY 5TH. IN SACO, MORGAN Sturdivant, WMTW NEWS 8 NOW. MORGAN, THANK YOU. WELL, THANK YOU FOR TUNING IN TO THIS NEWS 8 NOW UPDATE. I'M ERIN O'VALLEY. MAKE SURE TO CHECK BACK ANYTIME ON OUR WEBSITE, WMTW.COM, FOR OUR NEWS AND WEATHER. HAVE A GREAT DAY.